Hello, welcome to another video for New Catholic Generation. I am Ned from Parables of the Film Industry. This is my good buddy Mark. Oh, we're good buddies. We always have been. Always will be. Anyway. Okay, you two, break it up. <laughs> Get a room. <laughs> and we also have uh, Tatiana from Brownies. <laughs> I am what, awful what, with names, what guys. Next? What next? Am I from apologist? Yeah, you're just from apologist. <laughs> I'm from apologist. You're just Joe. You're an average Joe. Yeah, exactly. uh, there we go. Average Joe. Uh, my goodness. Uh, then we have Joe from the Catholic Apologist. We are here to watch a trailer. Which they won't tell me what it is. It's for the movie Samson. <gasps> oh. Now they just told me what it is. <laughs> Deep is my excitement to be sitting next to you at this time. And I don't know how I should feel about this. And it is being made by the creators of God's Not Dead. Oh, this is going to be a great movie. Let's just, I just can't wait to get... Shut up, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> All right. But yeah, it's made by Pure Flix. It's made by the same people who made God's Not Dead. So... Are you guys ready for this? Yes, I am. I know you're ready for this. You're ready for my torture. <laughs> Let's roll. Oh, my favorite logo. Oh, gosh. Men's in skirts. <laughs> and oppressed people. A hero chosen by God. Stories. Stories of possibilities. And I hope. Oh, there he is. Hope is rebellion. Scrubbed out. Enemies. Samson, after trying of death, chosen by the living God. Gifted with his power. To be his hand of vengeance. He man. I mean <laughs> Samson. Oh. <laughs> If you wanted to fight, you should have brought more men. Will this be the first R-rated movie from Pure Flix? <laughs> 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 Those are some very oiled up looking men in that video. That's my first thought. I, I, I was getting a lot of uh, 300 vibes. <laughs> this dark is awesome. camera and the oh, light. Really? This <laughs> is Israel! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, all right. What'd you guys think? I don't know. I mean, it looks not pure flicksy, even though it's from pure flicks. I will grant I it that. Yeah. Where is the Mercy Me soundtrack? <laughs> <laughs> I was promised a Mercy Me soundtrack. <laughs> that will come in the credits. <laughs> they've, they've, they've adapted their uh, checklist of things exactly. that are needed for a pure flix trailer that's what it well, is if it's if this looks edgier so they might use skillet but an acoustic version of skillet just <laughs> yeah. so they don't scare people too much yeah. for the edgy crap that is the oh. only way you guys will appease me okay pure flix that's the only way you'll appease me to have some skillet in this movie seriously skillet is amazing they are though <gasps> <sighs> did you what notice did they that decide Billy's... together <laughs> that was so cute <laughs> did you notice that Billy Zane was in that that Billy Zane yeah a famous actor. Apparently not famous enough for you. Uh, oh, uh, I, I know who he is, but um, uh, who was he in the trailer? I don't know what his name is, but I was I uh, I don't know if you heard me, but I was just like, oh, there he is. Because he's oh. in one shot of the trailer. And okay. I was very, very surprised about it. I'm surprised how many like actors they got in mm. this. Um, like big name actors, because Billy Zane is in it. Um, the person who played Jasper from Twilight. He's in it. Um, <laughs> oh, quality right there, guys. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> I wonder how many bottles of gold spray paint they want. They went through for this movie. Like, from what I could see, a lot of things were just spray painted gold, including mm -hmm. some of the people. Mm -hmm. I don't know. There's not much about Philistines in the Bible, but I think we could extrapolate out that they were definitely painted gold. There you go. There, there were some go. sparkly men in there. <laughs> that's, that's why they had the Twilight actor right there. <laughs> but, uh, no. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. To, to be a little bit brutally honest, like I, 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 I'm not gonna like say that the movie looks awful or anything. Um, 
which it doesn't look awful. I mean, it, I mean what, it's a trailer. We're not, we're not going to go yeah. ahead, be able to go ahead and like make this well, final statement. The movie's bad or good. I love that there was only one fight scene that you saw. It was yeah. just cut out throughout the entire yeah. movie. I, I, I do like that because there are a lot of trailers which like show like multiple fight scenes from like you know across the whole movie. Yeah. So it was kind of cool that they only showed one action scene. The jawbone yeah. scene. It's, I love the jawbone. It's going to be interesting to see how you know because I don't remember Pure Flix doing many Bible based movies. Yeah. From at least from you know again from my memory that's not something they normally do. So I'm going to find it very interesting to see how much they stick to the story of the Bible, how much license they choose to take with this story, or if they're just going to be pure hiss. And <laughs> oh my gosh, that was ter- that that was painful. My heart hurts. <laughs> Crucify me now. Uh, that that comes like a thousand years later from the story where the story is happening. So. What'll be interesting? Not to interrupt you too much, but. I just a little if, bit, though. Just, just a little yeah, bit. Yeah, because I don't yeah, know if any of the rest of you saw the Bible series that came out a couple of years ago. I, I did saw. Yeah, I did see a little bit. I did see the Samson story. Actually. The Samson episode was really good. He yeah. looked like Ike Nadolo, and Ike Nadolo was beautiful. But besides that, it was also just really well done. I thought, mm-hmm. just making Samson appropriately hulking and scary, but also weak and having his own personal issues, like all great heroes of God do. Mm-hmm. So um, I'll be interested in seeing if this is better or worse than that, because that was that was fairly well done. Mm. Well, actually, that, that comes as high praise, because I heard that the Bible series wasn't that good in many words. They cut out of most of the stories, because you can't have all the stories, oh, but nice. I enjoyed the Bible series. Well, it lasted. AD was better. The Bible continues. Yeah. Because St. Paul was just the biggest jerk, and I was so happy watching God knock him off a horse. It was great. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, my gosh. But, yeah, I'll be – I will admit I'm very interested because I I like biblical epics. It's actually really hard for me to not like biblical epic um, sometimes. (laughs) (laughs) So I would be very – I will be very interested to see how this does turn out. Yeah. Yeah. He's interested for a Pure Flix movie. Oh my goodness. Shocker, guys. Uh, You're just full of surprises. Obviously, my only worry, and I'm sorry to go ahead and say this, guys, I really do not like the God's Not Dead movies, and I have no faith in them whatsoever. (laughs) Really? Oh my gosh, I thought you loved them. So, with that in mind, that they are actually making a movie that I'm even slightly interested in, that's... That just means they've grown as filmmakers. Exactly, exactly. So I am hoping that... I am hoping, to some regard, that this movie actually does turn out good. I re- and I mean that from the bottom of my heart, even though I hate the God's Not Dead movies. But um, I don't try to hate Christian movies, guys. I didn't want to like it. I tried so hard not to like it, but I kept laughing. <laughs> Maybe the directors of those movies have been watching New Catholic Generation and have seen your reactions and are responding appropriately. I would love to meet you guys, to some regard. <laughs> um, I, I, love I, I swear I would not bite, I, and I really much. mean that. Much. Mm-hmm. Yes, thank you. It's not venomous. It'll just sting a little. It, it, that would definitely. A little <laughs> Might need some penicillin, but that's fine. He's like it. <laughs> Exactly, exactly. But, uh, yeah, I, I, I'd say I, I'd go and review it. I'd go and review it. Yes. You're not so, coming. Mar- <laughs> <laughs> Do you, would you say maybe you'd be interested in seeing it or not? Mm, I'd be I'd be interested. Okay. I'd be interested in seeing it. It's not something that I would go and uh, spend my own money towards. Of course, there's not much mm-hmm. I would do these days. So, like, I mean, so it's not, like, good enough. Like, yeah. it's so good, like, I don't care if I hardly have any money in the bank. I'm doing this anyway. It's not to that point. I don't think the trailer, like, I don't think the trailer gave enough for me to be that interested. But... I'd still be interested in seeing it. Okay. I'd see it if I could sneak beer into the movie theater. I like you. <laughs> I like watching bad movies when I have something to slightly throw. vicious in my hand. Like something to drink. It's a little little weird. Taste that as well. We watched Christian Mingle a couple uh, weeks back with oh some of my God. friends. I know, literally the worst movie I've ever seen. We had uh. to watch it with Moscow Mules. It was great. It made the whole movie so much better. I can imagine. I'm 21. Yeah. Don't if anyone sees this, I am 21. It's okay. <laughs> You're not promoting something illegal. Oh, Don't sure. ever drink to excess. I've never been drunk in my life and never will be. Neither have I. Yay, fist bump. <laughs> Woo! Duck tails. 
<laughs> this is a weird panel. It really is. <laughs> it's a very strange panel, but hey. Strange, strange, mo- strange, strange movie, strange panel. Oh, yeah. We should review out. Stranger Things. I agree, we should review Stranger Things. Or, well, actually, you can just come over to my channel, and then we can review Stranger Things. Can I come on your channel and review Stranger Things? Yes, you can. Yes. We, we will make this a thing. Let's not do this now. How could you invite yourself and just not wait for him to do it? It's not like he just did it right here and there. Like, uh, oh you think God. I care about any of you? <laughs> no, you and your beard just want to go and watch <laughs> crummy movies. I'm offended. Anyway. <laughs> Moving on. All right. So, well, you got our opinions. We're not hating the movie. We're not. Yet. 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 Definitely emphasizing yet. Uh, we definitely didn't hate the trailer. I would say that it definitely made me interested. Um, Which is the trailer it's supposed to do. Exactly. Um, yeah. Well, at some point, we'll probably review it. This has been New Catholic Generation. God bless, guys. And we'll see you later. Bye. 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 Thank you.